finally time to extract your precious honey. That's the sweet reward for all the love and attention you've given your bees throughout the season. When you're going to extract your honey, we recommend you to invite your friends and family to join you. You'll see everyone loves to see how the honey is extracted, and it's also way more fun. That's why I invited Alex to join me. There's four steps that go into extracting your honey. First, you want to uncap the frames, then spin them in the extractor, run the honey through a filter, and you're ready to bottle your honey. Make sure your frames are at least two-thirds capped before you extract them. Okay, let's dive right in. So first, you want to take one of your honey frames um, and put it on top of your uncapping tag, just like this. And with your uncapping fork, you want to remove the first thin layer of wax the bees have put on top of the honey cells, just like this. Make sure to work slowly and try to not forget any. Now, Laurence is an expert. She's just taking the very top layer of wax off. You want to avoid going too deep or you'll break the cells and we won't be able to use these frames for the next seasons. This method or this process is going to allow the honey to flow freely once we set it up in the extractor. Okay, so now that it's done, you want to take your frame and put it in your extractor. So, once your frame are uncapped, you want to put them in your extractor. You'll see the extractor moves quite a bit under the centrifugal force, so you'll probably need some help to hold it while you're turning the handle. Alex? Let me help you. So you want to turn the handle approximately two minutes on each side. Okay, <laughs> you'll see this is quite the workout. So if you have a lot of honey to extract and you feel like you might need an electric extractor, reach out to us and you can rent our extracting facilities. Now that all the honey is extracted from the frames and has accumulated itself at the bottom of the extractor, we're going to elevate it. Now, come and place adequately your pail and filter under the extractor just like this. If you need to, use the plastic spatula to go and scrape the honey on the side of the extractor to make it fall to the bottom. And here's the final result, a delicious pot of golden honey ready to be enjoyed and shared with your friends and family. Enjoy.